Scandals and Secrets, on board the world's most exclusive private residential ship, it's a floating city exclusively home to the 1%, a playground for multimillionaires and billionaires that circumnavigates the world's oceans, welcome to the world, an exclusive private residential ship home to 165 super luxe apartments. This vessel is shrouded in secrecy and buying a condo on board is an invite-only situation, you've got to be nominated by one resident and seconded by another. A net worth of a cool $10 million is said to be compulsory, if you're imagining decadent parties, filled with intrigue and free-flowing champagne, essentially a maritime episode of the HBO series The White Lotus, you're perhaps not far off. At least according to one ex-passenger's account, I'm not saying that everything that happened on The White Lotus has happened on the world, but I think, in large measure, the comparison is not inaccurate, former resident Peter Antonucci tells CNN Travel. There are a lot of wealthy people doing playful things, sometimes naughty things, sometimes scandalous things. Antonucci is a retired lawyer who spent six years as a resident of the world. In 2019, he sold up. His reasoning, once you've circumnavigated the globe a few times, you've seen it. I had seen what I wanted to see, I was ready to do something new. Back on dry land, Antonucci started going through the journals he'd kept during his years on board and decided the country club meet sorority house vibe was the perfect inspiration for fiction. Antonucci's since written three novels set on a fictional ship, the most